Hi, I'm Joe Luca, your 2018 president of the Rhode Island Association of Realtors. Wow, does time fly. It seems like just a short time ago, I was talking to you about my goals and objectives for my presidential year. Referring to NAR's Own It theme as a guide, I wanted to be educated, inspired, and engaged by our members. You did not disappoint. By engaging with you, our members, I was educated about what was getting done and inspired by so many of your fresh ideas. Over the past year, we had many accomplishments. NAR and other trade associations now have access to health insurance for all of our members. Additionally, in the face of rampant tax reform, NAR was able to fight for and retain mortgage interest and property tax deductions for many homeowners. NAR has even given us the Center for Financial Wellness, a website that helps realtors plan for their financial future. These are three examples of how NAR constantly fights for its 1.3 million members. At the state level, the Rhode Island Association of Realtors has been successful in six of our nine legislative initiatives. Additionally, our Global Business Initiative has also continued to move forward. We have developed relationships at MIPIM, the largest real estate conference in the world that will yield benefits to our members in the years ahead. For the first time ever, the Rhode Island Association of Realtors has an ambassadorship with a foreign country. We are now ambassador to Norway, so we can have a business and cultural exchange with a wealthy, vibrant European country. Why do we do this? To sow the seeds that will yield opportunity for our members in the coming years. Wouldn't it be great if we could look beyond the boundaries of our small state, our region, and our country to work with lenders, buyers, developers who are not susceptible to the fluctuations of our local economy. This is what the Rhode Island Association of Realtors is laying the groundwork for now so that we can benefit in the years ahead. In closing, as Dean Tatanencourt takes the reins of this great association, I want to wish him Godspeed during his presidential year, and I want to thank all of you, our members, for your support throughout the year. Your emails, your letters of congratulations, your Facebook posts really meant a lot. Thank you for the opportunity to serve as your president. It's a year that I'll never forget.